Waking Up With Us. It is Monday, July 8th, and you're watching Hometown This Morning. I'm Courtney Rowe. And I'm meteorologist Vanessa Alonso. Courtney, welcome back and happy Monday, everyone. It is time to get back into routine. Fourth of July just came and went, Courtney. I know it really did. And you know, we had some beautiful weather this week in Vanessa. I was very thankful. I mean, it was perfect for 4th of July, able to shoot off all the fireworks, no problem. Oh yeah, and the best part, there wasn't any humidity. So it made it even better. Temperatures were in the 80s. It was pleasant. Yes, we did have some showers and thunderstorm chances, but it wasn't a complete washout this holiday weekend. So I hope you got to enjoy it. This morning, we are waking up to some clouds as the sun is rising as we're looking out to the north on our tower camera here at the KQ2 studios in St. Joe. We're right now, we're waking up to 66 degrees with a calm wind. As many of you are getting ready to head out the door and get your new work week started as now we're getting back to routine after a long much rested few days with the 4th of July holiday weekend temperatures as you're heading out the door very comfortable across the region in the 60s across northwest Missouri and northeast Kansas now we have been dealing with some clouds moving into the region over the last several hours areas out to the east of I-35 from Chillicothe into Kirksville are waking up to rain showers this morning as we're getting a lot of tropical moisture coming up from the south all courtesy of Hurricane Barrel, which made landfall a little over an hour ago and is now moving inland over Texas, bringing heavy rain and a tornado potential to the Houston Metro. This storm is going to be moving to the north and to the east and will be bringing heavy rain and flooding concerns to St. Louis and to Cape Girardeau and the Boot Hill of Missouri over the next 24 to 36 hours. So do keep that in mind if you're planning to travel towards the southeastern part of the state. Temperatures for us this morning will remain very pleasant in the 60s to near 70 degrees. Temperatures by the afternoon, lower 80s. I will have the complete breakdown of what we can expect heading into the new work week coming up in your seven day forecast in 10 to 15 minutes. Courtney? Well, the kind